This is Guggen Cassis for IFL TV. I'm really out of breath at the moment because I ran to, to get my card. So thank you for waiting. Congratulations, Zerdo. How do you feel? I feel great. I feel great and, and great to be a champion, unified champion. How tough was Chris Billum Smith? Oh, he was super tough, super tough. And I tried to knock him out, but I couldn't. He take all the punches. I mean, he's really tough. Julian, just come in a, come in a bit more there. Uh, game plan go exactly how it was meant to go? Exactly how it was meant to go. You know, um, I knew he was going to be really tough, um, but I didn't think he was going to be that tough. He, he, he took everything, and hats off to his, his grit. That, that's a real man right there. Absolutely. Um, some of those rounds were really like everyone was uh, hands uh, in front of their faces because the, the shots that were going were, were very taxing for both fighters. But Billum Smith took those shots. Uh, we saw he's obviously hope he's all right. I think he's had to go to the hospital. But um, yeah, it was a, a great fight. Yeah, it was a great fight. And I still have a lot of respect for him. He's a great champion, top fighter. But uh, I still won the belt and I took it. A lot of questions now about what is next. Obviously, Jay Appetit is there, which is the fight that you'd want at some point for 2025. Is that is that fair to say? Yeah, of course, that's the fight that we won. And I mean, I won all the belt. I won all the belt. Julian? Yeah, I mean, it doesn't matter if it's Jay, it doesn't matter who it is. If they have a belt, we, we want to fight him. Oscar De La Hoya is still talking about you and uh, Alexander Usyk. I think that's a, a dream of uh, Oscar's. Uh, he's saying that he's heard that Usyk at some point could be coming back down to cruiserweight. We obviously know he's fighting Tyson Fury soon, but you'd welcome that fight, you said to me the other day, you'd welcome that fight with Usyk. Yeah, of course, that's a, the fight it, it can happen too. In the near future, if he comes down, uh, back down, I mean, we can make it, make, make it happen. What do you think about that one, Julian? Yeah, yeah, I mean, yeah, if he comes back down and the, it makes sense, let's do it. We're not ducking any smoke. Okay. So it's all about next year now for you, obviously. The elite fighters only fight twice a year, so I suppose at some point in the middle of the year or whenever the first quarter that Zerdo will be back out again. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. As much as we can be out there, uh, we're going to be. Have you got anything else you'd like to say, Mr. Ramirez? Uh, thank you. Thank you, everyone, for the support. And, and, and they have a champion for a long time now. Nice hat as well. Thank you. <laughs> thank you very much, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.